Hello and welcome. Welcome. Just look at my tops if I've got any bits of <laughs> breakfast on there, but it doesn't seem to be. Perhaps I should have kept that quiet. That might have been an internal thing there rather than a, a verbal, but hey, never mind. So hello and welcome to Relax and Sleep Hypnosis Daily. My name's Jason Newland and my website's jasonnewland.com. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. So I'd like you to get comfortable sitting down or in a chair that supports your body or lying down on your bed. I'm going to ask you to close your eyes. This is going to be a mindfulness session. Because we're just going to focus on what's going on in the moment. Now you can hear what's going on where you are. You can hear a bit of what's going on in the background here as well. Because of the microphones. Of course I can't hear what's going on where you are. But just notice. The immediate sounds. So you've got the sounds. In the background. You've got the sounds. The further than the background really, you know, they're quite a long way away maybe. And you've got those sounds that are quite close by. Perhaps the clicking of the radiator, the fridge turning on and off, perhaps something like that. Uh, cars in the road outside your house going by or parking. Sounds of car doors being closed. Maybe more in the distance, you've got sounds of planes going by above your home. Maybe a you know, long distance away, but you can hear them faintly. Perhaps you've got the sounds of the birds in the garden. I get that quite a lot here. Not today for some reason. Not quite sure why that is, but often there's a lot of bird activity. Which personally I find to be one of the joys of life actually. Bird song. Except pigeons. I don't quite as, as enjoy pigeons, but I've got Herbert the pigeon that comes and visits me. Though I haven't seen him for a little while. I hope he's okay. Maybe you can hear things even further in the distance. For me, there's a motorway, and it's quite a quite a distance away from here. It would take me about twenty minutes to walk to get there. I can hear it, but it's more of a kind of more of a foggy sound. You know, I can't really hear individual cars generally. It's just a, and I know that it's busy right now because this is peak time in the morning. So I know that it's going to be very busy on the motorway. I just hear a, this blanket sound. It's, it's quite, very quiet actually. It's 
more at night when there's not much going on and a motorbike goes down the motorway and it just seems a bit more louder because they get a chance to speed and stuff. But at the moment, traffic's going to be fairly slow because at the time of the day, It's interesting how, even though this is a mindfulness exercise, I find myself getting just a little bit caught up with content. And also adding information that perhaps isn't necessary. And how much of that is because I'm making this recording and how much of that would happen anyway, I'm not sure. So now to do that same process without adding any additional commentary would be I can hear the motorway I'm noticing the birds are starting to become more Well, more noticeable. They're not loud. They're fairly quiet today for some reason. As you turn the focus towards yourself, observing how you feel in this moment. Being aware of your physical being. I'm starting to notice the energy moving through my body. My fingertips are buzzing a little bit. I can feel it in my chest, in my knees, my legs, my feet. I can feel it in my jaw, my throat, my back. Just the energy. It feels nice. My breathing is much easier than normal. It just feels loose. So much more loose. Free and easy, peaceful. Very peaceful. Not 
expecting anything. Not demanding anything. Only noticing what's happening. Right now. What's happening. This very second. Allowing yourself a chance to take this opportunity to observe yourself physically and emotionally without judgment. Instead, looking through the eyes of love and kindness, forgiveness, Positivity. Using those lenses to see yourself. So that you can see not just who you are now. You can see who you can be, who you will be. The possibilities are endless. You can see in your mind's eye a future life after you have decided to embrace forgiveness. Forgiveness towards yourself, forgiveness towards everybody else. Forgiveness towards yourself and forgiveness towards everybody from the present and the future and the past. Not just forgiving what has happened or be done to you, against you, but also forgiveness for what may happen so that you don't even have to think about it. Which allows you to see the future through positive eyes, expecting only wonderful things to happen. 
expecting happiness. Looking through the eyes of love, forgiveness, positivity and optimism. expectation of good things happening every day. Expecting the best. Appreciating not just what you do have, but what you will have. Prepare in your mind for future happiness. Embedding those seeds into your mind that are already activated to grow and grow. Increasing that motivation and positive Feelings that you can feel physically as well as emotionally. As those positive, optimistic, joyful sensations move through your body. Now, on the top of your head, through your face, eyes, jaw, your neck, shoulders, arms, hands, chest and stomach, all the way down your back, your hips, buttocks, groin, legs, feet and toes. All of your body embracing that positive idea that every day gives you something to look forward to. And every day you come closer. to even more happiness as that happiness increases not just in your mind but physically you feel calmer physically you feel loose you feel peaceful, your mind slowed down, allowing you to take your time when necessary. To feel at ease. To be at one with yourself, with the universe. Letting go of everything and anything that's no longer useful to you. 
letting go. Letting go.